I'm sorry about that. Um, it ended up abruptly because of the well, there was a problem with the charge. Uh, there was no charge on the camera. Now here uh, I was saying about the the graphic card here, right? So I brought it for like 15k, and uh, surprisingly, it's still the same price. And um, yeah, this graphic card is really good because um, it comes with uh, some kind of aluminium. That's what they say, and uh, it has a coolant. Um, which is uh, defaultly inside uh, this graphic card. So this is by Asus and uh, the graphic card number is 560Ti. Now I know that uh, there are 600 and 700 series out there and you have Titan as well but why did I choose this one? It's like this is the best available graphic card two years before and uh, it's still the best available graphic card currently and um, that was a bummer. I know that uh, graphic card you have to update it each year or every two years but still I'm gonna stick with this because I, I played Battlefield 4 here, uh, the beta edition and it worked awesome. So I had this ultra uh, ultra graphic settings and uh, there, there was some lag here and there I think it's, uh, it came around 40 FPS um, but uh, you know uh, if, if you keep it on high. Uh, the, the graphic card works really awesome. I think like both the, the, the CPU and also the graphic card is uh, well being used on the game. And I have only 4 gigabyte of uh, RAM. Uh, that, that is by Crosshair. Uh, I have like 10 years guarantee with that uh, RAM. So uh, I, will, I will zoom it further. Now you can able to see the graphic, uh, the RAM here, right? So it's from Crosshair. I don't think there is any way I can turn on the light. But anyways, um, trust me, it's a cross crosshair. I brought it for like 2000. Uh, it's a 4GB one. I'm planning to buy one more with 4GB. Now here, the hardest is I have uh, the last one is uh, this one is 2TB. Uh, the above one is 1TB, uh, and this one is uh, 5. Well, um, no, actually, it's a. Um, I think it's 250GB hard drive. So um, this hard drive is from Seagat and um, these two are from Western Digital. Um, I mean there was some problem with this hard drive so I had to replace it. Uh, now they have uh, given me the hard drive because the previous versions of hard drive comes with 5 years of warranty. So it's been like 3 years since I brought it. I brought this one 3 years and uh, 2 TV and 1 TV I bought it recently like 2 years before. And uh, this one is like uh, my oldest hard drive ever. I think the whole PC, uh, both the CD-ROM and the hard drive are the oldest. Uh, so I think it will be around uh, 4 years and this will be around uh, yeah 4 years more or less. Um, and uh, I will install my operating system on this one uh, because it's quite stable and it's, it has like uh, 7200 RPM. And these two are with uh, 5200 I think uh, RPMs. But why I gave this one my uh, operating system is because uh, it's it's lightweighter. It's 250 GB, uh, so things will load faster, and also it has 7,200 again it loads faster. And um, and uh, I, I thought of going to an SSD, but uh, I stop right there because SSD 64 GB is around 5,000. That's too much of a asking. And uh, I, that's why I, I didn't go for the SSD. Uh, but I know that it's, it's really fast, but then I don't need the fast one. But I, I think like this is faster. Uh, I will be showing you the boot up speed and how fast the processing is. Um, so there you can identify it. Now, uh, the, as you can see, the CD-ROM is disconnected. Um, it's not connected because we don't use CD-ROM anymore. So I'm just having there, uh, just like that. Um, so I probably have to throw it uh, in some days when I get another hard drive or something like that. So um, my recent purchase would be uh, Western Digital Hard Drive External. Um, it looks glossy. Um, it's uh, a two GB, uh, sorry, a two TB uh, hard drive. It is, and uh, I actually got it for the PS3 games. I already have an hard drive over there. It's 500 GB, but that's not enough for me. So as you can see, it's that's from Seagate. Uh, you get the logo there, right? So uh, it's basically from Seagate for my uh, PlayStation, and uh, have other two remotes there. So basically, I have all the games for PS3. 
and uh, I don't think I will purchase my PS4 any sooner uh, because I am I am like uh, a guy who will wait for some miracle to happen so uh, the price will fall down and then I buy it after that mm. so uh, that's about my hard drive and uh, this one stores my operating system basically all everything about the operating system is stored in the 250 GB and these two will have the backup and also I configure a backup for some important files and also like uh, uh, this, these two drives will hold my uh, collections of movies uh, I have a huge collection of movies and games, PC games and PS3 games, so everything will be hoarded in these two hard drives and um, uh, if I want to take a backup, I take it in my external hard drive and then format the hard drive or something like that. So that's one, uh, that's, that's something I want to show you about my PC and that's all. So uh, uh, this case is something I brought it uh, about two years older, I think it's two years more or less. Uh, I think I brought it with the motherboard and uh, uh, the CPU. So I, it was a different purchase. Motherboard and CPU, I brought it like two and a half, three years before, and uh, graphic card three and a half years before, or two and two years before, I think. And the hard disk one I brought one year before, another one was three years before. So it's like. I, I keep replacing things and uh, things are like moving on and the speciality about this cabinet is it has the the switch over here which is useless now and you have the USB on the top and uh, you have the this one again it's useless I'm not using it uh, because the, the the cabinet is a little old all those uh, uh, extra components which is dedicated for this cabinet is broken so uh, one thing which is working here is the fan over here. There is a fan over here which sends out all the heat uh, by uh, by the front side. So you have uh, one over on the back which is SMTS. So this will send the heat towards the down facing and you have a hole over here which will send out the, the heat the outside. And uh, my CPU doesn't uh, overheat that much. So I think uh, it perfectly works now. So. Um, my processor has been both of the uh, normal to 3.5 and uh, its maximum runs on turbo mode 3.9 yards. That is something I have said you already. Uh, those two fans are useless, I'm not using them. So uh, I have two network cables, you must be wondering why I have two network cables here. So one is one network cable for connecting from my uh, modem to the computer. Uh, as you know it's a old computer so it doesn't come with a uh, the default uh, Wi-Fi adapter. I can uh, can buy an adapter for Wi-Fi, but this way um, the, it's it's very fast um, the computer. And um, I normally watch uh, movies from uh, from the network uh, from the network to the TV over there. So uh, if I buffer it over the Wi-Fi because the DLN or DLNA is being used uh, to for a you know uh, for a wireless transfer, but I still use this one because uh, I watch movies which is 10 GB, 12 GB size of the movie size is 12 GB and I have 40 GB movies as well so uh, over the network it keeps buffering and it's kind of uh, annoying to wait for the buffer to complete so uh, I thought like when you go for the network LAN cable it would be uh, tremendously fast and that's that's how it is I can even uh, buffer 40 GB uh, from, from my internet so it works like from the computer it goes to the modem via the network cable number one and from the network cable number two it goes to the TV there so uh, it's basically a 47 inch L uh, LG 3D TV uh, which uh, takes the input from the modem. It doesn't use Wi-Fi. Again, I'm telling you, it doesn't use Wi-Fi because I'm having the network cable routed to that one. So mm, that's why I have two cables over here. So that's there. And uh, the speakers are here. I'm a laptop. Uh, this I brought it a year ago, I think six months ago. And uh, it's, it's proven to be a very good investment. It's Lenovo. I know it's a Chinese brand, but it's so good. It's so freaking good. I still use the uh, the laptop keyboard skin there. As you can see, it's i5, 8 GB uh, RAM it has, and uh, it has 2 GB of graphic card. I think it's 350, uh, sorry, 3, uh, 345M. Uh, that's the graphic card which has. 
and uh, it comes with two-year accidental guarantee with uh, warranty and blah 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 so it's 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 a pretty good investment even though it's a 50k worth it's worth it and the monitor you see behind it